Hi, I'm Karen from Cafe Bebe, and I'm coming to you today to discuss how lives change after babies. Um, it's a topic that we're discussing on the Brit Mums Network, and I have to say, our lives have changed infinitely um, since having Little Miss in 2008. Um, my husband and I met in 2005 through happy circumstances and had a pretty quick um, courtship and engagement um, and then were together for a, a year before we actually got married and then um, so that was in 2006 that we got married and then um, we had basically about two years um, to ourselves as a couple before we um, had our little miss. One of the um, things we would have liked to have done is had a bit more time together, but um, our, our advancing age and uh, ticking clock of mine um, sort of ended that idea, and we started working towards having a family. Before Little Miss came along, um, we traveled a bit more, not, not very far, not vast distances, um, but uh, we traveled back to America for a, a couple weeks. We, um, my husband's sister, my sister-in-law, who is the person that brought us together, um, she and her family lived in Geneva at the time, and we went back and forth to Gene Geneva about five times over the course of a year, um, because at that time EasyJet was considerably cheaper, and uh, we were able to just pick up and go. Um, we. I think that was the biggest thing when before we had children was or child um, children on the way was that we could just pick up and go. Um, we eventually added a dog um, to Sinjin, our dog, to uh, the family, so that made it slightly more complicated. But um, before a, a child came along, the ability to just grab your gear and and head out was pretty attractive at the time. Um, I wouldn't change one single thing about what we have done, or how we've done it, or when we've done it, but it definitely has changed how we live our lives. Um, I'm now a stay-at-home mum. I never would have thought that I would be a stay-at-home mum. Uh, not that I was overly career-driven, but um, it just never occurred to me to stay home with my child. I just thought it was something you did to put them in childcare and someone else raised them, sort of. But um, my as soon as I gave birth to my daughter, I knew I never wanted to leave her with anyone else. So my idea of motherhood and working and career changed dramatically from what it was before she came along. Um, how we spend our time is considerably different now. Um, we only have sort of windows on the in the evenings and, and on weekends to spend as a couple, so that's definitely changed. But we have a totally different dynamic with our family in that we love spending time together and we choose to spend our time together most of the time. Uh, very rarely will Mark or myself go off um, on an adventure or, or whatever on our own. It's generally, you know, our, our goal to stay together as a family. So that's of primary importance to us. Um, the other thing that's changed dramatically since um, our daughter came into our lives is our home. And I'm going to take you on a, on a quick little um, tour of our home, particularly the downstairs area, because the kitchen, the lounge, and the garden have changed dramatically since um, our daughter arrived. And um, I looked at some old video last night uh, before we added all the accessories to our garden that we now have, and it was a beautiful, quaint, lovely little English garden, and now it is the garden of a family, uh, the garden of a two-year-old. Uh, soon to be three year old actually um, and our lounge is no longer just a utilitarian adult lounge it is a children's play area if you'll see behind me by the brightly colored boxes um, and I love it it's it's not something again that I would ever ever change yeah it's nice to have shiny lovely things but that's life that's kids and that's what we um, bargained for. We wanted to be parents and we are very, very happy as parents. So that's how our lives have changed since having um, our daughter and I would say infinitely for the better. And I'd love to hear what you have to say about it, how lives, how your lives have changed, how your house has changed. So feel free to add comments at the bottom and I look forward to reading them. Thanks very much. Bye. Right, so this is our kitchen. Um, 
<clears throat> you see by the refrigerator, this is a refrigerator of a family. I'm not showing you the inside of it because it's deplorable. Um, but there are tons of magnets, artwork, pictures, um, all sorts, mainly all contributed by Innocence Movies. We have a television in the kitchen now, we never used to, um, which is generally perpetually on CBeebies. Um, the kitchen is relatively tidy, I must say. Oh look, there's a pineapple. Um, but it's also strewn with lots of bits and bobs that obviously show that it is a, a child of, or a home of a child. Um, bubbles on the window ledge and um, oh, children's kitchen accessories, a pile, oh Charlie and Little Magazine, yes, you know what it's like. Then we have our big storage unit. We had a big makeover in the kitchen at the beginning of the year and that's our storage unit filled with all sorts. Um, and our lovely dining table, accompanied by a trip trap, which every family home should have, and um, lots of oh, accessories that really should be cleaned up. So that's what our kitchen is like as a family, and that's how our lives have changed in this room. So our lounge, we have changed this room a lot, and it is basically furnished by IKEA. Um, again, I'm showing you a bit of a mess because that's what life is like. Um, but we've got two IKEA couches that are um, basically wash and wear. We have a new telly because we couldn't bear to watch telly on horrible old things. We have examples of Little Mrs. artwork on the window ledge and a very old fireplace that definitely needs replacing. Oh, we have in our shelving unit, oh, a bit of a mess. I like how um, we've got the child's vacuum next to the mummy and daddy vacuum, which is perfect. Pictures everywhere of Little Miss, of course. The requisite baby bed, so one can put one's dolly to sleep. We also have a recent acquisition of a stain, a biro, felt tip marker stain on the uh, couch, which was courtesy of Little Miss the other day. And then, the big change is the back area of the lounge is now Little Mrs. Play area. We bought this um, Expedite shelving unit at Ikea the other day and um, bought boxes, colorful boxes to go in it. So now all her toys are categorized and lovely and accessible to her. Little play table, little kitchen, easel again from Ikea. Um, so that she can be creative, and a small little piano and golf set. Just what every two to three year old needs. So this room is very child friendly. Um, the table, oh, very much changed since I'm um, having children. It's now my office because I work from home. I want to do blogging and social media. There's TweetDeck. And um, eat my lunch at the computer as well, which is ever so helpful. So that's the ever changing look of the Cafe Baby Lounge. And now Lounge. I bring you our garden. It used to be, like I said, a quaint English garden. Now it, well, it still has some original features, like the grill and a nice table. We do have some chairs somewhere. But I bring you to the playhouse, the Wendy house, the requisite Wendy house that every good garden has. We've got the balance bike, we've got a chair, we've got a bag, we've got the sandbox that does Daddy's head in because the sand does not stay in the sandbox. Slightly grown up feature with the um, swing, but it gets readily used by the youngster and the trampoline, which was added last year. Both the trampoline and the house were birthday presents for Little Miss last year. Um, so that has rendered our, oh look, there's the trike underneath on the back of the trampoline as well. Um, so basically I've rendered our garden into a toddler friendly zone that is entertaining and suitable for young people. Very different to the garden it used to be. Still very pretty. We still have a few flowers and some strawberry plants from last year. But for the most part it is the garden of a toddler. Thanks very much for viewing, and I hope you can see how much our lives have changed since Little Miss has come along, and I'm wondering how much yours have. Bye!